Frankfurt Zoological Society has a long history in conservation in Africa. In Zambia, we've been working here in partnership with Zawa since 1986. This 24-year-old partnership has seen the poaching brought under control and conservation operating in the wider ecosystem and becoming effective enough to be able to bring the rhino back. The five runner that arrived today will be in the Bomas for between 10 to 14 days here at the Holding Bomas where we'll see them released shortly. After that they'll be moved over to the Release Bomas and that's in a temporary fence sanctuary which is about 100 square kilometres. They'll be released from those Bomas, free released at night very quietly into that sanctuary. That'll take them quite some time to adapt, at least a year probably. And after that ad adaptation period we're going to look at taking the fence down as well so that they'll be able to move more freely throughout the national park. I'm here with the, the black rhino that have just come in and I basically spend, um, spend time with them, get them tamed down, get them used to people and noises uh, for the journey so they're less stressed for, for their journey. I travel with them uh, and then settle them in here in the Bomas, stay with them through the entire time they're in the Bomas here and then release them and I'll usually stay on for a little while after they're released just to make sure none of them have any problems. Over the last five years we've had an EU funded project as well as this one here on the ground where we've been working with communities and, and other stakeholders in the wider ecosystem. I'm Mr. Junza Gift from Katiunga Basic School. We've come here with the pupils so that they can see the type of what a rhino looks like. We are here just to enjoy and look at the, the rhino. So for we have a 24 year history now this year working here and that's all been focused in the North Luangwa ecosystem and within all of that we've had this rhino project that we've been fundraising for separately and individually and it's really just the cherry on top, it's, it's the success of all of this work. So we fundraised for it especially, this, this flight today was fundraised from private donors and from the US Fish and Wildlife Service in, in the US um, and it's been organizations like that that have helped us and Zawa achieve what's happened today. Thank you.